M0 FXB, welcome to my channel. I thought I'd show you the scope settings on the Yaesu 857D. So all you do is nice and easy, hold, just push the function briefly, okay? Until you're in the F menu settings. You know when you are, because it will say MF here, and we're on H, it says H there. As you turn, the, the, the letter changes, H, I, J, see that? Go to the one that's H, and now you have scope. To turn the scope on, you just press scope. Let's see if we can get that to zoom in a bit nicer. Let's just push it now. And the scope starts. We're just on 40 meters at the moment. Press it again to turn it off. And look, you've got wide and step. So we'll go scope and we'll show you what happens. So if we push wide, Push it again. See what happens? It starts to get a lot thinner and wider. We can also select the span. So we've got 1K, 2.5K, we can go narrower. 5K, 1K, and 2.5K. I think it's quite good. Let's change the band. Let's go up to 1.5. So even while you're on, on scope, you can still change the band. And by the looks of it, even the mode. I think that's quite handy. If you come out, press the A, and there's your selections there, wide and step, and scope. Back to 40. Uh, I can see that I'm not changing frequency with the VFO, large VFO. I'm doing it with the small. It's probably because I'm in the wrong mode, so let's have a look. Let's go to... SSB, then scope. Yeah, and I haven't locked the VFO. So at the moment, the VFO, the large VFO isn't changing, but the small one is. Look, I'm sure there's a setting there, but look at that. I think it's quite funky. Thanks for watching my channel. Catch you on air. Bye for now.